Okay, we just got to our Airbnb in LA. First look, if we could get the door open. Great. It's a nice size Airbnb. Here's the kitchen, little living room set up, and a balcony. I probably should hurry up and call her back before she drives 30 minutes. No reason they wanna see us in the back. It's nice and spacious in here. This is the bathroom. Nice shower. This is the room. If y'all can see the room. And this Airbnb also comes with a laundry room. That's it. Time to eat. So we were about to go for a walk and we just happened to catch a glimpse of this beauty. This is the pool area of the apartment we're standing here in LA. This is beautiful. I think I want to buy a bathing suit. Hey guys. So it is our second day here in LA. I have such a horrible hangover but we are getting ready to leave our airbnb go pick up our rental car because we didn't end up getting the rental car yesterday like we were supposed to so we missed almost a whole entire day yesterday but we still had a good time we had some cup company over for a couple hours and it was just a good time good vibes shout out to them but I didn't get any footage. Uh, I probably was too tired. Right now, we're about to get out, go pick up our rental car, and probably go get breakfast. So I will vlog, and I will be back. And hopefully, when I come back into the camera, I'll be looking a lot better. And I also forgot to tell y'all, so this morning when I woke up, I fell out the bed. <laughs> it was so embarrassing. I don't know how I fell out the bed. That's why I don't drink. I'm sleepy. I'll make sure I vlog and let you guys know where we go get something to eat at. They say lucid in the front. That would do too. We just rent it for the remainder of our stay here in Cali. Oh, I love this uh, panoramic thing. Look at the panoramic. Obey traffic laws. Be alert and use voice commands while driving. Head northwest on Pacific Avenue.
And then we have Isis with her feathers crown. This one here represents more about like abundance, future, and growing up family and business. Don't let it rule you. Everything's gonna be alright. Get out. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. I got it. Okay. I think it's worth investing in when the feeling is mutual, when both parties are really excited, when, oh God, when there's like these little moments of magic. Feels good, it fits right. We don't move too quick. Got hers, I get mine. We say, ooh, that's it. Say what I feel is a fact. She said she feel it right back. Got sentimental, lock the momentum. Said what I meant though. Yeah, I got what I give. Can't block what it is, and I'm not on the triple play. Turn right. <laughs> You have arrived. It is our third day in LA. Headed to go get breakfast from a place called a Soul Food Shack. Take the next left on the East Queen Street. I'll Western enter the clips. On the north. Francisco Bank. Paul oh, didn't know him at the time. We didn't know him. It's San Francisco. That year was 1980. Uh <laughs> When it comes up, I'll box it myself. No problem.
how tall he said he was? Seven? Wow. <laughs> I guess you gotta find it somewhere up here. We charge more for peel. It'll be like this. Oh no, it can't keep. I can't even go there. Thank you. Okay. Let me show you what's going on. Okay. It's our last day in LA. We're headed to the beach. We didn't catch the sunrise, but we're headed to the beach for a little bit before we get on the plane and go home. We really had a time. And all the food that I show in all of my clips were 10 out of 10, except the cheese steak. That wasn't good. Or the tacos, they weren't good. No, they weren't good. So yesterday, in the scene when we were in Glendale, Cal Glendale, California, we uh, stopped at New what is it? Cheesecake Factory, and got cheesecakes. This one is the pineapple upside down cheesecake, and this one is the red velvet cheesecake. I like this one better. Ten out of ten. Did you have fun in LA? My baby. Going home. Home stretch. Ooh.